Hello and welcome to another scripting tutorial video. Today we'll be creating custom mob drops. Uh, this could be useful for a custom RPG or anything really. Uh, yet again, this is a basic tutorial and you will need to customize it to your own needs. So let's start coding. On death, uh, this is an event that will be triggered when the entity dies. And now we need to write victim is a creeper. Uh, it's a conditional that will only continue if the entity that died is a creeper. Obviously you can edit this to your own needs, a spider, or even a player. And then we will be doing cancel drops. Uh, this is an effect that will cancel any drops the entity normally drops. For example, if it was a skeleton, it wouldn't drop any bones. And if it was a player, I think that would just stop him dropping his items. Uh, and now we can use drop one emerald at location of victim. Uh, I've tried this with event location and for some reason that doesn't work so we have to use location of victim. Uh, this will do what it says, it will drop one emerald at the place where the location was last seen, or the victim was last seen. So now if we save that, we go back in game, do SK reload uh, on the file, we can spawn in our creeper. I uh, didn't mean to do that. And it'll drop an emerald. Uh, so yeah, you can customize this to your own needs and do whatever you need to do. Maybe if you want custom currency, you could do that. You could drop a scripted item, or you can really drop anything you want. So just edit this to your own needs. Uh, I hope you did enjoy the tutorial and it did help. And please leave any tutorial suggestions in the comments.